making a ton of food today. Starting here with this big, I don't know if you can see it, it's a pretty big pot with uh, three pounds of, let me see, ground turkey and uh, some garlic and a whole large onion in there. So, uh, as I get this browned, I will uh, gather up all the other all the other ingredients and this will end up being some uh, southwest this will be uh, southwest chipotle uh, ground turkey for those interested and um, this will be a base I've got about 10 more pounds to cook um, I started with three usually I make about 20, 20 pounds of this ground turkey base um, for uh, various recipes. So I do cook uh, either no salt or low sodium, low fat, plus the ground turkey. Um, I try very hard to keep the carbs down. Uh, but as far as the meat, this is 93.7. Um, it's not dry. Um, you can actually add a little water, um, but I, for this one, I'll, for this, 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 these recipes that'll be coming out, I won't have to because I will be putting. Let's see. Um, I will be putting the um, chipotle. I mean the um, diced tomato, green chili, no salt. Um, I will be putting in the no salt light red kidney beans and let's see oh yeah the uh, no salt corn and let's see Walmart messed up my shopping haul they gave me reduced sodium black beans this time um, which really won't make too much of a difference I hope so that's basically what I'm going to be putting in this for my south um, Southwest Chipotle um, ground turkey and all these yummy no salt vegetables for uh, for my um, my salads and um, I eat this on top of uh, my salad. Of course, I heat, heat this up. I do freeze the portions, and it gives me about two weeks. This particular three pounds will give me about, uh, yeah, about two weeks worth of salads, and um, if I do it more in wraps, then I get a little less, because, and I do, I haven't made my own wraps yet, I haven't done that recipe yet, but I use these uh, low sodium flour tortilla wraps with that base with all that, those ingredients popped into it. And it tastes really, really, really good. Um, I don't miss ground beef. I don't miss salt because I use so much chipotle. I use literally. Uh, where is it? I'm looking for it now. Let's see. I use um, one whole. I throw this whole thing, this whole container. Of, uh, no salt. It's salt free. Chipotle Southwest. I, I don't. I don't taste the ground turkey because I really don't like ground turkey. <laughs> um, so I put that, and then I use the um, garlic in there. So I really don't. I don't. Uh, I don't miss salt. I, actually, I was a type of person that really never liked salt to begin with, though. But I know it does give great flavor to meat. And, but these uh, spices. Um, and uh, all those vegetables we're going to add will will make this taste really really well. And also, I will add. Let's look inside here. Um, this three pounds. I use a lot of jalapeno peppers. Um, so I will use probably three of these jalapeno peppers in that in three pounds, maybe four, and then I have uh, 
all the green bell, pe green bell peppers. I'll put in there. Probably two, two each, and the, the red bell peppers. I think I'm trying to think if that's what else. I, that's it. And then what I do is for my salads, I use this um, Chobani Greek yogurt, um, no fat, plain. And you can actually put dill, garlic powder, and mix that in, I think onion powder, and it tastes like ranch. So I use that on my wraps as a sour cream replacement and as a dressing replacement for the salads. Okay, well, look for more of my recipes coming.